Delta Education has a 30-year commitment to quality hands-on science education. For more than a decade, the activities in the Delta Science modules have successfully engaged students in inquiry-based learning. These comprehensive kits are user-friendly for all teachers, meeting the needs of both those who are at ease teaching science and those who appreciate more support. The third edition of the Delta Science modules offers a powerful combination of hands-on science and reading. The Delta Science modules program has 58 titles of Delta Science modules covering life, earth, and physical science topics. The scope and sequence shows the titles most appropriate for grades kindergarten through eight. Each module includes approximately 12 classroom tested activities plus student readers and comprehensive assessment. With each Delta Science module, you will receive an equipment kit with enough materials for 32 students. In the kit, you will find a comprehensive teacher guide in a three ring binder complete with background information, a teaching schedule, and step-by-step -step instructions for each activity. Most Delta Science modules have an accompanying Delta Science reader that is developed to support the content of the module. Eight copies of Delta Science student books are included in the kit. The K-1 modules also include one big book. The kit includes a teacher's guide, enough equipment and materials for 32 students, and eight copies of the Delta Science Readers. K-1 modules also include a big book. Prepaid living materials coupons accompany the modules that require live organisms. Redeem the coupon approximately four weeks before you need the organisms. Refill kits are available to replenish the consumable items used up during the activities and individual replacement parts are also available to replace those lost or broken. The DSM Teacher Guide provides all of the science background and key points for guiding the hands-on activities. The module overview provides a general introduction to the module an overview chart highlights the activities and objectives of each activity. It also shows the science process skills featured in each activity, vocabulary introduced, and Delta Science Reader pages in each corresponding activity. Detailed science background is introduced. This is an adult discussion to help guide the teacher through the science content presented in the module. All of the vocabulary to be introduced is listed in bold print. The materials section lists all of the materials contained in the kit. Equipment marked with an asterisk is considered consumable. It is important that teachers distinguish the difference between permanent equipment and consumables so that they do not discard permanent equipment. Materials contained in the tubs are listed in alphabetical order on the outside label of each tub. Any materials that were shipped in other cardboard boxes are marked with a special symbol. Items to be supplied by the teacher are also listed here. These are generally common classroom items, audiovisual equipment, or materials that do not ship well in the tubs. Hands-on activities section starts with a summary of each of the 12 activities and the teaching schedule. 
classroom and materials management suggestions and advanced preparation instructions are also offered. Every activity follows the same format. Activities are usually designed for students to work individually or in groups of two to four. Objectives show the focus of the activity and student goals. Schedule suggests how much time and how many sessions to allow for the activity. Vocabulary lists new words or concepts introduced in the activity. The vocabulary words are defined in the glossary. Materials, items used in the activity. Quantity needed for each student, team, or the class. Preparation gives step-by-step -step instructions for what you need to prepare prior to doing the activities with the class. Background information is provided to support the teacher's knowledge and understanding of the science content of the lessons. Suggested answers for activity student sheets are also included. Guiding the activity in the design of the lesson, there is a two-column format. The left column contains step-by-step -step directions for guiding the activity and completing the activity sheets. The lesson steps are numbered and the questions are in bold print. The right column corresponds with the left column and contains additional support information. It gives suggested student responses, tips for facilitating the activity, and safety reminders as necessary. Every lesson has a suggested reinforcement activity. These are suggestions for students who need more experience with the concepts. It may also be used as an ongoing assessment opportunity. Science journals suggest ways students can add to their science journals or portfolios. Cleanup includes materials management suggestions to facilitate the cleanup and return of materials to the kit. Science at Home offers follow-up activities that students can do at home. Connections are extensions and challenges and cross-curricular suggestions for language arts, math, social studies, health, and the arts. At the end of the activity pages are the instructions and answers for the assessment activities. The last page of the hands-on activities section is the glossary. Teacher pages for the Delta Science Reader include detailed support for guiding the reading, suggestions for pre and post reading, preview and summary assessment questions, and a writing link. The teacher resources section includes the unit test answer key, additional resources and websites for students and teachers, classroom safety notes and science safety rules, and correlations to the National Science Education Standards and Project 2061 benchmarks. Copy Masters include black line masters of all student activity and assessment sheets, the unit test, an assessment summary chart for the teacher, and a letter to go home to parents and families. Delta Science modules offer frequent and varied opportunities to assess students' understanding of the science concepts and skills in the unit. Ongoing assessment the highlighted questions in the guiding the activity or guiding the reading offer embedded opportunities to assess comprehension. Performance assessment 
In section one of the activities assessment, students demonstrate their understanding of the science topic and apply critical thinking skills as they complete a hands-on task. Formal assessment. In section two of the activities assessment, students analyze and interpret information that is presented in a visual format. In section three, students demonstrate critical thinking skills as they apply concepts. In the teaching pages for the Delta Science Reader, key comprehension questions are listed in after the reading section. Writing links provide critical thinking questions. The unit test covers key vocabulary and concepts from both the hands-on activities and the Delta Science Reader. A unit test is included for all modules in grades two through six. Students select materials for a portfolio these may include activity sheets, assessment sheets, and or student responses to review, assess, or writing links for the Delta Science readers. Teachers can use the assessment summary chart to help determine whether students have mastered or not mastered each of the skills or concepts. A plus, check, or minus can be placed in the grid to indicate not appropriate or gave no answer, appropriate but gave one or more incorrect answers, or appropriate and gave no incorrect information. This chart does not pertain to the unit test. Delta Science readers are six page nonfiction books for students with informative and engaging text and full colored photos and illustrations. The readers provide science background and information about the unit topic, offer opportunity for reading in the content area, support and extend experiences and content of the hands-on activities, help students develop informational literacy skills, serve as homeschool link, promote scientific inquiry. Most Delta Science modules include eight copies of the student reader. A big book is included with the K-1 early primary modules. Each reader has three main sections. Think about, has key information about the unit topic. People in science includes historical biographies and careers in science. Did you know has high interest articles or selections. Delta Science readers include standard nonfiction features such as table of contents, headings, captions, labels, diagrams, maps, and glossaries. The articles in Delta Science Reader should be introduced after the hands-on activity. The teacher's guide identifies the pages most appropriate for each activity. Each article is accompanied with directions for teaching the reader pages. This section also contains information for introducing the reader to learn how to use the expository features. These features help students get more out of the text. Skill Builders for Delta Science Readers give students an opportunity to review a specific literacy skill using the Delta Science Reader. The literacy connection and skills that may be practiced are reading, comprehension, cause effect, comparing and contrasting, drawing conclusions, fact and opinion, main idea and details, making inferences, predicting outcomes, sequencing, and summarizing. For grammar, such as 
capitalization, parts of speech, parts of a sentence, plurals, possessives, punctuation, tense, subject verb agreement, types of sentences. For writing, audience and purpose, brainstorming ideas, genres, organizational strategies, transitions, paragraph structure, topic sentences. For vocabulary, analogies, anonyms, compound words, context clues, homographs, homonyms, idioms, prefixes and suffixes, root words, synonyms, word families, and word origins. Skill builders should be used after students have read the corresponding reader pages. Students look back to the reader to find examples of the focus skill or use the content of the page to complete the task.